Chase Jackson providing personal and professional vitality to our corporate vice president prospects and customers. Topic of our video today is on the consequences of drinking milk from a cow. Let's get going. Cow's milk has three times more protein than the milk that you received from your mother when you were a newborn. Why is that? It's because that milk was designed to grow a 50 pound newborn calf to over 300 pounds in one year. It was not designed for us as humans and there are no scientific benefits for us in terms of our body in drinking milk, only negatives. Also, cows today are producing 25 times more milk than they did 50 years ago. And that is because of all the different steroids and chemicals and all kinds of different stuff that they are fed. So who knows what's really in that stuff that we drink from the cow. But don't drink milk. A great analogy to look at when putting milk into our bodies is imagine that your body is a motorcycle and instead of feeding it gasoline, you're feeding it jet fuel. And the jet fuel that you put into your motorcycle is not going to make your motorcycle go super fast or run for a longer time. It's going to make it break down. Putting jet fuel into your motorcycle. What have we learned so far? We, as human beings, are, our body is not designed to ingest milk from a 1,500-pound cow. What else have we learned? Milk provides little to no nutritional health benefits to us human beings. It only provides benefits to a calf. Imagine that. No benefits, not designed for us. What about consequences to drinking milk? Milk and its contaminants are linked to cardiovascular disease, diabetes, cancer, all major problems in America today. Got milk? Hell no. Clever business and marketing strategy of the day is by the dairy industry when they put out the idea that 2% milk is a lot healthier for us than whole milk. Er not true. 2% milk is actually, what does it say when we hear 2%? It's that 2% of this milk's calories come from fat. That's not true. Actually, 35 to 40% of the calories in that milk that you drink of 2% come from fat. The way that the dairy industry comes to this number is they mix the milk with 100% calories come from fat with water and that is how they measure and get to that 2% number. Imagine mixing a stick of butter, which is 100% calories from fat, with your 8-ounce glass of water, and then calling that 2%. Very misleading, very beneficial to their marketing plan and pocketbook, and very consequential to our health. 2% milk, not good. 1% milk, not good. Skim milk, not good. Whole milk, not good. Milk from a cow, not good. For decades, it has been mass marketed to us the benefits of drinking milk from a cow. We now know that you do not want to drink milk from a cow. Easy way to increase your personal vitality, don't drink milk from a cow. Do I have milk in my fridge? Got milk? Hell no.